going to show you how to lower a car today and how everything works on it. Alright, so here we go. You're going to want to get a jack. These are two jacks because I need this. This is called a scissor jack right here. I need to use this one because my car is so low that this jack will not fit under it. So, first you're going to want to jack your car up to get your wheel off. And I'll show you a quick, quick demonstration on that. Even this is a jack wheel that fits under here. So this is the jack. Use this to raise it up so I can put my other jack under. Now I've got this jack on. I don't need my scissor jack anymore. You got this on? But before you can get to actually lowering your car, you're gonna have to take your wheels off. So you gotta loosen all your light bulbs like this. I got all those loose. Now I can get back here. Finish it up and pull it up. That is set. When you jack your car, you don't want your wheel off the ground. So when you get your bolts off, you can pull your wheel off. So I'm gonna take these off. Come on. It's kind of pain in the ass, but... Right. Got all my bolts off? I have this on. This is called a space It goes behind the wheel. So, when you have a lowered car, everything sits down lower to the ground, obviously. So you're going to need this spacer to push your wheel out from the suspension over here or else it'd rub against the coil over. This, this is called a coil over. It's much different than the, than the normal suspension, the normal struts and everything that are in a everyday car, which is really stupid. Everyday cars are really dumb. This allows your car to sit lower to the ground or higher to the ground, or higher off the ground, but no one wants a car that's as high off the ground, that's just, that's just dumb. Yeah, it's it looks pretty much the same as normal s suspension, but these two rings right here, these rings allow your car to go lower to the ground. I'll show you in a second. I need to get my tools. These are called coilover wrenches. These go around those two rings that I just showed you a second ago. These allow you to loosen them or tighten them. I'll loosen those rings right now and show you how the how those spin make your car go lower to the ground. Got my wrenches right here. I'm gonna put on this bad layer right here. You put one on the bottom going left. Put this this one in my right hand on the top ring. This stupid thing will stay on. Now they're both on. Now you twist. Now if you'll see, see how that ring spins? I can spin this down as far as I want. If I spin it all the way down like this, then that'll make my car super dumped and it would just be retardedly low. I mean, that's what I want, but I can't do that right now. So, or you can spin it back up to the right and make the car high off the ground which is stupid. Nobody wants a car that's high off the ground. It's dumb. Alright, so I showed you pretty much the main parts and coilovers. I mean, show you how to lower them, show you how to raise your car up, show you how to jack your car up to get the, the wheel off, show you taking all the lug bolts off. So now I'm gonna put the string back up here. Use my coilover tools. Make sure everything's tight. 
Here. Those are tight. These aren't going anywhere. I'm gonna put my wheel back on, lower my car back down, and I'll show you what a lowered car looks like in a second. Got my wheel back on, I'm just tightening those white bolts back down. It's much easier if I had a torque. I power tools, which I do over on the counter. That's just called me being really lazy. Boom. Now that everything is back on, my car sits lower than an average car, if you have not noticed. I mean, right now, it's not that low. So I have to do a bunch of stuff to it still, but... Everything under the car is decently close to the ground. Like this, my oil pan pretty close to the ground that's a problem but yeah that's pretty much how you lower a car with coilovers hope you enjoy my little video of showing you guys how to lower a car yep Everyone should, everyone should lower their cars. It's fun. See you later, class.